Drive Down Preview. Come around, we've got Paul. Evening all, we're on the Mickey. Two way to Obi for Steve Bruce. We are. Are you optimistic? More optimistic than what Rob is and me? Yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, we've played on the promoted side. We've got Norwich, Villa. We've got to do it against one of them. <laughs> um, and, and to me, I've got a feeling it's going to be a 2 2. I said in the preview yesterday in the private group for those of you that are in there, it hint, everybody else. Um, then I thought 2-2, but there'll be goals in this game. I think you will make changes, so I am confident that we're going to be uh, seeing a few spread about today. 2-2. Johnny. Hello. <laughs> we're, we're beating the big teams. I know it's flashlight out here. Uh, I Later on in the season, you expect Sheffield United to drop down the table? Um, possibly, but you've got to give Chris Wilder a lot of credit. Um, However, I disagree with the fact that everyone's been a bit pessimistic. This is Sheffield United, it's not Liverpool, it's not Manchester City. I think this is a game on paper that we could definitely get points from. Um, but they've definitely been the surprise package so far this season. I think it's a very well-oiled team. They, they do play very similar formations to Newcastle with the three at the back as well. With the uh, well, three centre-halves and the two wing-backs. So it's going to be a tough game, but the fact that we've got to play against Manchester City last time out, I do expect Newcastle to get something from this game tonight. Where's the key battles, Paul? It, it, to me, it's it's the battle is with which Newcastle turn up. Yeah. We've got to go with the right mentality from the off, and the, the players have got to be on it from the off. Um, and I think if we play, certainly I want to see Gale play today. I've been um, pushing for this for, for quite a while, and I think if we can get him up front, give him the service, he knows where the back of the net is. Uh, and if we can get our noses ahead, confident, I'm confident of getting at least something out of this, out of this game. But um, yeah, it, it's all about us tonight. It's what Newcastle turn up. It's what Steve Bruce can motivate us, uh, you know, to do. Because Rafa said last season, you've got to keep on at this group of players to get the very best out of them. So I hope that Bruce doesn't take the pressure off, thinking, oh, wasn't the Man City result great? Keep the pressure on the lads. Make a few changes. Bring in the likes of Gale. Maybe bring in the likes of the Longstaff brothers as well, the pressure up and Shah, your favourite. And um, let's try and get our noses ahead and get a positive result. But it's all about Newcastle tonight. It's, it's all about the it. it's all about the tune, Rob. Um, what would you do with that front three? Because Southampton on Sunday, I personally think that's a bigger game. Yeah, I think tonight a lot of it depends on how well we do on Sunday. If we get a point tonight, that'll only look good if we get the three points on Sunday. And it's a not a good point if we don't get the three points on Saturday. Um, what do we do with the front three? Now, I'm in favour of dropping Joe Linton because I hope and I think that that might get a reaction that we need out of him to say, look, not, you don't get a God-given start. You don't have a God-given right to start just because of your price tag. You need to earn that place in the starting eleven. And Dwight Gale, you know, he's been working hard. Andy Carroll, I don't think, will be exactly fit enough to start, but uh, yeah, put right. Gale in. <laughs> uh, ASM, I'm not concerned about I know he hasn't scored as of yet, but he does create so much, and he gives us so much excitement, so I, I've got no concerns of uh, Sam Maximan. Almond, though, I would actually quite like to see Atsu start tonight ahead of Almond. Oh, that's interesting. Bold statement, but that's how I feel. Right, so coming up tonight, of course, we're at the way day, you know what's coming, we've got a match vlog. Uh, I think we've got one of the former fan cam members down here as well with her. And of course, we've got player ratings, scoring the players, and the final word. And don't forget that Amazon link is in the description. Ta da!